Uh oh. Ah! Wait. Do I look like a waiter? Before we head deeper into the forest, there's something you should know. Uh oh. What is it? The echoes of those who once lived are not the only inhabitants of the spirit realm. And I'm not talking about my kind, either. There actually exist many different ethereal entities. Some of them friendly, even helpful in some ways, albeit rare. But then there are the malevolent kind. Oh, you mean like West Ham Sandwich? And Cynex? We call them... Roamers. They are a vile race, constantly moving from one place to another, seeking to absorb energy from anything they come across in an attempt to grow in power. And as a bound, you will be their target now too, I'm afraid. Uh-oh. That's no good. The roamers use the energy they absorb to multiply themselves. And that's why their numbers are constantly rising. I heard their cell phones roam a lot, too. Like a disease spreading through the spirit realm, soon affecting everyone. One of our most important tasks has always been to keep them at bay. What, what to be fair, I haven't, uh... I haven't seen a Captain America or Avengers movie, so... I had no idea. So these roamers are the monsters that Grandma was talking about. And they are now all over the forest? Any way to defend against them? I don't have a shield, man! Hold out your hands. Uh-oh. When they come after us, your wooden toy will be completely useless against them. Uh-oh. What are you doing to me? Don't touch my uh-oh spot, sir. It's sacred. Come on, another sword? Trust me, this is the best weapon for the job. Maybe it's Excalibur. And it's not just any sword, it's actually really quite special. It is what we call a conduit. Oh. Conduits are special artifacts that function as links between the realms. Connecting every level of existence to another. Cool. And that makes it possible for me to direct my energy through it. To enhance every strike you make with it. Any roamer unfortunate enough to get caught in the blade's way will most definitely feel it. Conduits are hard to come by, so take good care of it. And roamers are always looking to get their hands on one. We're not going to let that happen. I've seen you swing a sword many times before. Wooden or not, you are more than capable of handling yourself with it. Can't do that on television. Good times. Well, yeah, but swatting a couple of angry wasps is a different thing. You need to trust yourself more. I'd rather not. I have trust issues, you know. Give it a try. It almost looks like a key. Okay, here goes. Oh! You have received a spirit sword! Now you have the means to defend yourself against the roamers. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I just said that, you turd. I know you want to help your grandmother, no matter what it takes. Remember, Arietta, we're in this together. The only way for us to stand up to them is to combine our strengths. So you make that sword swing, and I'll make sure every hit it lands counts. Right. And please, call me Ari. Ari? That's not the name of the game! What are you talking about? We got a spirit sword. Ooh. Get that bad boy. I like that sound effect, though. 
still don't have like a menu thing you can go to. I want a menu, damn it. I want to be able to look at my stuff. I don't have one. Ooh. This is spooky! It's all dark and such. It's all dark and foreboding trail roamer. Okay. Looks like a slime. So I guess with the wooden sword, uh... You wouldn't be able to damage these guys. Recess? Trail Roamer! Yeah! Whipping that ass. Oh, we don't want to do that. Oh, Reese's! I thought you said recess. I was like, what? Whatever you say, man. Whatever you say. I can't get to that bush. It's 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 behind a log. Whee! And there's two of them. It's a handicap match. It's not fair. Yeah. Going through the underbrush. Fiery wasp. Yeah. Fiery wasp. Goodbye, sir. I don't think the sword actually does more damage. Oh! You hit me! You just hit a little girl! What's wrong with you? I'm just a child! You punk! You can't go around hitting children! What's your problem? Jeez, you're worse than that Zomadoke guy. That guy's bad. That guy's bad news. Don't mess with me. I got a freaking sword. What's that? Is that a... Looks like something's on the tree, but I guess you can't do anything with it. There's a log. I don't know why, but this area kind of reminds me of the Minish Cap a little bit. I don't know why. You hit me! There's a heart? Kind of looks like the heart pickups from, uh... God, what's that game called? Uh... Binding of Isaac, that's it. That's what I'm thinking of. Yep, it's brand new. It's not even out yet. I like the music here. It's, it's kind of relaxing. Sort of foreboding, but it's also kind of relaxing. So. That's cool to you. It's a log! Uh-oh. Something's gonna happen. Uh-oh. Yeah, they do. Has no picture, but it is there. It's Midri. Hi, friend. Lots of roamers out tonight, don't you think? Not safe. Not safe at all. I tells ya. You better get inside while you still can. Something ominous is in the air. Don't worry, I didn't fart. It's not me. Wait, you're a bound, aren't you? I, uh, I guess. 
great. Tell you what, come and find me tomorrow and we'll do some business, you and me. The name's Midgery, by the way. Oh, but now I gotta scoot. When Ben Stein's money is on, I can't miss that. Certainly not safe here tonight. Woo! And he's gone. What? What was that all about? That was a Medarian, one of the ethereal races that inhabit the spirit realm. They are friendly entities who work as a sort of merchants in the realm. Oh, maybe I can buy some items. They are completely harmless and actually very helpful. They deal with anything, but just like me, lack the physical bodies needed to acquire anything by themselves. So they use bounds as mediums to bring them whatever they might want at the moment. And it's usually well worth it. We should definitely track them down once we get the chance. Cool. And just when I thought this m this night couldn't get any weirder... I mean, I, I don't have any money, so... You know, I I know how I'm gonna buy anything. Now I can't swing. Oh, there it is. It it won't let me swing my sword down here for some reason. <laughs> What's up with that? I guess because that's cutscene area. So you you just can't do that. Can't do that on television. Can't even do that on Eureka's Castle. Okay. Try over, Homer. Ow, he hit me! He hit me hard. Boom, 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 boom. Now I need two more hearts. Oh, I found one. Cool. He's hitting me, the little jerk. Somehow. He, like, cheap shots you. He gives you the old sucker punch. Bat! Go back to Castlevania, sir. Your presence is not required here. Do, 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 do you want to go over here? Oh. I think there's a cave back here or something. Kind of looks like it, but we can't get through. That bush is too thick. It's been working out too much. Been spending too many days at the gym. You better hand it over. You don't want to piss Reese off. Hold on just for a second. Look. See it? There is something shining on the ground. That's Grandma's ring! Just like she said. And no roamers in sight. Let's grab it while we can. It seems odd. Why would they just leave? They, they probably quit like Vegastar. Maybe Grandma got it wrong and they weren't after the ring. Uh-oh. Huh? Rot row! Oh boy. That's like a big slime. I think we're in trouble. <laughs> Those eyes. What is that? Uh, it's one huge roamer, I can tell you that much. Oh no. It's absorbing energy through the ring. I think we're in over our head here. This is bad. It can do that? No time to explain. Ari. What we do is your choice. If we leave now, it'll only get stronger and start to multiply. But I'm afraid it might be way out of our league already. Oh boy. 
This is definitely not the way I planned this night to play out. You make the call, but I don't have a phone. Given the circumstances, retreat is as good plan as any. Yeah, but risk losing the ring? We can't lose the ring. No way. Trust yourself more, right? World of Tanks? I'm currently a tank in FF14. Okay. We are taking it down, down, down to Cripple Town. Yeah! Uh oh. Huge roamer. Oh, I pushed the wrong button! I rolled right into it. It was not cool. I can't hit it. I can't move! This is not a good thing. Oh! I died! I lost! Game over. Restart boss fight. Heavy character class. Who, who's, whose job is to basically take the hits. I see, I think you, yeah, you, you gotta wait till it wears itself out and then hit it. I see how it works. I'm currently a, a, a marauder since I finished the uh, gladiator and paladin classes. I see how this fight works. I gotta get a subscription and uh, the expansions before I can become a Dark Knight. Th this fight's actually pretty easy when once you figure out what to do. Rolling is actually really nice in this game. Subscription's $12.99 a month, I believe. Got it. Good job. Hey, you handled yourself great. I knew you had it in you. I'm actually going to try and get a subscription on the third. That's for the standard subscription. I think there's a premium subscription for like a few dollars more. That lets you make more characters or something, but I don't really care about that. I knew you had it in you. These roamers were probably drawn here because of your grandmother. She was in more danger than you could ever imagine coming all the way up here alone. But in the end, it... But, but in the end, it doesn't even matter. It seems they found the ring more interesting rather than her. Strange there were so many of them in the forest, though. I wonder where they crept out from. Yeah, I'm looking forward to doing a DPS class, like, you know, Lancer. <laughs> I have been a pugilist before, though. Hey, we can talk about it later. Let's get back to the cabin. I'm sure Grandma's eagerly waiting for us to return, and there's probably more reruns of Win Ben Stein's Money. Yeah, let's go. Dun dun dun. I used a sword as a gladiator and paladin. We managed to get it back. Really? Bless you. I didn't sneeze, you know. Discography! 
Now, come morning, my character's name is Xandark. Give it to your mother, and don't tell her anything about this. She worries too much already. Oh, okay. What will I say? Call her a pool expert. I mean, you're a clever girl. You'll think of something. Oh, okay. Well, it's my time to go. Please don't. Ari, you know I have to. I'm dead. Not a zombie, you know. Coming for your brains and such. Grandma! I'm going to miss this place. And all of you. The cool breeze on my cheek. Eating apples while watching playthroughs of Demo World. Those are cherished memories, you know. And what comes to your new ability? Arco told me all about it before. Do whatever you see best. Listen to your heart. Listen to your heart. She looks so somber. I love you. I'll be watching over you. Please. I'm sorry, dear. I'm sorry I got you mixed into this. It's all my fault. But for what it's worth, I'm sure everything happens for a reason. Grandma! Goodbye, Arietta. Bye, Grandma. Goodbye, Grandma. Poor Grandma. I love you. We never even learned her name. We still don't know Mom or Dad's name, either. They gotta have names. She... she's gone. I'm pretty sure Dad's name is Kenny. Is this... a dream? Can I wake up now? I'm really sorry. This all must be too much for you. After I came into contact with your grandmother, I made the choice to bring you to her. She was against it, as she knew what it would mean. But because of you, she was able to move on. That's nice. It's nice to move on on occasion. No, it's... I'm okay. I'm really glad I got to see her one last time. Thank you. If it weren't for you, I would have never been able to help her. Yeah, you, you would have gotten your ass kicked by the roamers. What happens now? You should go back to sleep. I'm sure there's plenty of episodes of Demo World you haven't watched yet. You might want to take some time to process all of this. Yeah, there is one more thing. Oh yeah? Like I told you before, we only share our powers with humans, who we deem worthy. Why am I worthy? I'm just a little girl! But you will also get to choose. The power that I have granted you can be unbound, if you wish so. It is a great burden to be carried, after all. The relationship between a bound and their spirit guide is always a two-way street. I bet it's Main Street. Your newfound ability is only active when we are together. 
Should you ask me to, I will release myself from you and everything will be just like before. Huh. But, the truth is, we need as many in this as we can. The number of roamers is rising faster than ever. That puts everyone in danger. Even Carlton Sheets. Hello, I'm Carlton Sheets. I began my real estate investing career more than 30 years ago with the belief that I could create wealth and achieve success in real estate. And the way you handled yourself tonight is nothing short of astonishing. I didn't think you could beat that thing. Take your time to think it through. Oh, okay. I... I should go back to sleep. I'm tired. You woke me up in the middle of the night, you bastard. I know you don't feel it, but it's freezing cold here. Let's get inside. Yeah. I didn't even I didn't even have time to put a jacket on. Arietta of Spirits to be continued. Wish list on Steam. It's already on my wish list, sir. So that's the demo. I like this game. I kind of want the full game when it comes out. It's nice. So that's the game. That was kind of a short demo, actually, but you know how it is. Do do. Well, it wasn't even an hour and a half, so. So that's the demo. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was fun times. And, uh, yeah.